Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm gonna have one of these new Prego Ready Meals. This is the pouch. They're microwavable in 60 seconds. Uh, this is the creamy three cheese Alfredo rotini noodles. Um, quick steaming technology. 390 calories, so it's not it's not low, it's right there. Um, eight grams of saturated fat, 880 milligrams of sodium, four sugars, and I think there's more than one serving in this bag. No, the whole pouch. The whole pouch is 390 calories, so I was thinking there was more. So uh, microwave directions only, they do not have stove top or anything like that. Um, so you place the unopened self-venting pouch in the thing. You just set it up just like that. Um, you put it in there for one minute or until hot. You let it stand in the microwave for a minute and you are too because it's very hot. And most of the time it's steaming out of these corners right here. So, and these are supposed to be the cool spots you can touch, but if there's steam coming out, it still will burn you. So let it sit in there for a minute. Um, the black writing underneath there says, um, for convenience store microwaves. So you might have to um, microwave it high for 30 seconds. So if it's a really high wattage microwave, you do it lower for only 30 seconds. Um, so anyway, then you remove it, pouch from the microwave using a cool touch areas. These right here, but be careful. Like I said, steam will be still hot. Um, tear it open, stir it, and enjoy it right from the pouch. Pour in the bowl. I, use it, I just ate it out of the pouch last couple times. And I've tried a paste one, and I've tried another one of these. So I'm going to get this in the microwave, and uh, I'll be back. Okay, I ripped the top off, and uh, this is what it looks like when it comes out of the microwave. And I have not stirred it yet, so... Pretty thick. I'm still reminded of an MRE or something, you know, like the, the boil-in bag where you just stick it, the, stick it in the boiling water and then you open it up and the stuff's hot inside. Um, that's what it reminds me of. It actually doesn't smell bad, but it just kind of kind of feels funny eating it out of a plastic bag. So maybe it's just just whatever. Maybe it's just me. So I'm gonna let this cool off because it's very hard. It's very thick though. I mean, it's very. I don't know, I won't say pasty, but it's, it is very thick. So anyway, I'm gonna let this cool off and I'll be back in just a second. Okay, it's cooled off a little bit, it may still be a little hot, but there's the bite I'm gonna take. Got sauce and pasta in there. It's pretty thick, I mean thick, thick. Um, doesn't have a bad flavor, it's got a little bit of a, have a powdery flavor to it, like a powdery feel to it. Like they've used powder to make the cheese, like a macaroni and cheese meal kind of thing. That's what it, that's the that's the mouth texture you get from it. The pasta is a little a little overdone, a little soft. Like I said, that that cheese is really thick. Um, this reminds me a lot of the um, Hormel meals, the little plastic shelf stable meals that you just rip off the top and eat it. Uh, it reminds me of that a lot. The flavors do. Um, it's okay. It's not spectacular by any means. Um, I'm gonna give it a three. It's not something I would eat necessarily again. I wouldn't go out and buy it. But if if Tam were to buy it, I would eat it. You know. But but I wouldn't actually intentionally go out and pick it out. Just because it's not it's not that spectacular. It's it's just okay. It's edible. It's not spectacular. So. Um, so anyway, I hope that helps. Uh, there's nothing you can really add to it to make it much better either. So uh, let's add some chicken in there. So anyway, hope that helps and thanks for watching.